So I'm here at Southern Hills Church in Las Vegas and today is Idea Day. And um, I'm really excited about this. Um, there, a lot of my friends are gonna be here. And um, I'm, it was really a ministry, idea, it, ministry day to share ideas. So um, I'm excited to share some of the ideas that I learn and some of my friends learn and introduce you to some of them. So I'm here with my friend Brian. We um, are just really good friends and just met in college and I've been really good friends since. And um, Brian, what's some other things you've been learning at Idea Day? I uh, just got out of a session uh, not too long ago about spiritual gifts and uh, just the encouragement that as we are the church, we're supposed to be using our gifts uh, in everyday life. It's not just something we segment of, hey, uh, I'm going to be in nursery at uh, 9 o'clock on Sundays and that's my spiritual gift, but actually living out, hey, this is what God's equipped me for. This is what the Holy Spirit has empowered me to do, and I need to live that out in my everyday life. Love it. So I'm here with my friend John, John Beasley, he's a um, pastor in Seattle and they recently started their church. Uh, John, what's some of the things that you learned or one thing that you learned at Idea Day or was reminded of? I think what I learned um, was the importance of having somebody as a mentor in your life. Mm -hmm. A lot of times as a pastor, I'm like pouring into people and I'm, um, I'm telling people like, hey, this could be helpful to you. Mm -hmm. and, but the importance of not just giving information, mm -hmm. but also inviting people in to I love it. my life and speaking to that. So that's, I think, yeah. the big takeaway for me. I love it. And I think, like, what, something that we've been taught about, like, I think all day through the conference is, like, even as leaders being mentored and even as I felt like I was from both sides, like, oh, I needed some leadership in my life, people speaking into me. Yeah. And yeah. I need to be speaking into other people. And I can tend to not, like, seek out for mentorship. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm like... Uh, you know, I don't want to bother them, but, um, but I love it as a pastor when somebody mm -hmm. says, hey, I want to learn, I want to yeah, grow. Yeah. So just having boldness about it and saying, hey, can you help me in this area? That's awesome. Um, and so I've, I've kind of listed out different people, like this is their competency, so I'm going to go and say, mm -hmm. hey, help me in this way. So That's awesome. So anyways, Sweet. thanks. <laughs> Okay, I'm here with my friend Steven, and um, we just had an awesome day at Idea Day. Um, Steven, what's some of the things that you learned today, or what's like a principle that you read? Um, honestly, it was just kind of something broad, but um, the topic of relationships in light of the gospel is super uh, important, and it was just something that impacted me. And in regards to uh, the workshops that we went in, volunteering, administrative, if we focus so much on the structure rather mm -hmm. than the people, it's not worth anything and so that's the biggest thing i would say to take away and there's a it's it's a broad stroke that i just yeah. put out there but it's something yeah. that I, I learned and regardless if it's volunteer administration how we even deal with people as yeah. pastors in ministry and that's awesome so, I, it's so easy i know to get like just busy doing stuff that we get distracted from just like right doing what we're supposed to do mm -hmm. serving people loving people helping people so, yeah thanks for sharing exactly. that yeah i hope it was help or Yo, so i um, here with Matt and Nathan, two really good friends since basically my freshman year of college. Matt, what's something that you um, were learned or was reminded of this I was idea I was reminded of uh, the importance of friendship and ministry. And um, it's good just hanging out with good other guys, serving the Lord. And uh, yeah, it's Amen. I love it, love it. It's such a Nathan. cliche answer. I know. <laughs> I learned there are tunnels where homeless people stay <laughs> underground here in Vegas. But other than that, it was a great conference here at Idea Day. And, uh, but... Yo, so thanks so much for watching. I had a lot of fun at my, in my quick little trip in Las Vegas and really enjoyed um, Idea Day. And really, like, 
uh, the emphasis of it was really like relationships and mentoring and investing in others. And I was just constantly challenged to um, just invest and build relationships with others and pour into other people. And also look for those people who are gonna um, just pour into me and teach me, just um, just mentor me and lead me to the person that I desire to become. And um, I, a lot of it was um, focused towards like pastoral church ministry, but there's a lot of just other great stuff. Um, if you're in ministry of any kind, the Idea Network is really cool to connect with and I would be a huge help to you. So I'll leave some links for their Facebook group and stuff down there. But um, hey, thanks for watching. I'm still learning to get better at these vlogs. Still a little awkward making these vlogs, especially like at events, filming, filming with other people, learning to do it well. Um, but hey, I'm glad that you're on this journey with me and watching and check out some of these other videos. And if you haven't yet, subscribe hit the notifications to be reminded when next videos are out. Thanks for watching.